today's warm-up number one divide and express your answer in scientific notation we're going to focus on the coefficients here of 7.5 and 5 and we're going to treat those like regular numbers so 7.5 divided by 5 will give us 1.5 okay so our coefficient that we're going to use is 1.5 times our base of 10 and then we have exponents of 18 and 3 so we're going to use in this case the quotient rule so the top minus the bottom would be 18 minus 3 which is 15 do we have that anywhere we do 1.5 times 10 to the 15th power a and number two with number two we're going to write as a fraction in simplest form we're going to say this, this is actually 18 hundredths so 18 hundredths the difference is is that this is a repeating decimal so in order to change that just need to subtract one from the denominator which will give us 18 over 99 and we do have that that's C in number three number three approximate to the nearest tenth we have the square root of 20 we have to think of the perfect square that's less than 20 that would be 16 and the perfect square that's greater than 20 would be 25 we can see that 16 and 20 there's a difference of about four units and from 20 to 25 is a difference of five units so the square root of 16 is 4 the square root of 25 is 5 so we know the square root of 20 is going to fall somewhere between 4 and 5 my estimation be kind of right in the middle like somewhere about 4.4 4.5 so do we have anything close to that 4.4 we do here it be